Day of being on our stage for season two. So sad. We've made so many awesome memories here. Not only season two, but season one. Like this is literally where it started for all of us. Let's go take a tour of the set while nobody's on it. So me and Coco like that we started this season two where we like drew little clues under hidden places in the sets. I think we did like six of them. We did in Gabby's room and the comms room and the chacha just so we could like come back season three and like remember this little scavenger hunt that we did. It's so weird to see this place empty because there's always so much action 24 7 so to see it all quiet and empty it's kind of sad let's go to principal swift's office gabby spent a lot of her days in here always getting in detention and <laughs> the paper clips that i uh almost killed nathan with during the pilot <laughs> Doing that scene where I'm like going crazy on his desk, I flinged this box of paper clips and like a few like almost poked him in the eye. It's amazing that he's still alive. Oh no, it looks like a crime scene in here. Sorry, it's like completely dark. Usually this place is lit, no pun intended, but it's always like bright and there's always a lot of commotion happening in here. I love this room and every time it's on screen, it just lights up the screen. It's so vibrant and bright. And me and Coco would sometimes come in here and eat lunch on the ground and then people would find us after looking for us for 20 minutes and we would get in a lot of trouble, but <laughs> it still was very fun. I do know more like a fish rides a bicycle. Fit in like summer in an icicle. Don't fight it, just be an original. <laughs> I never thought I'd get to a point where I had such a big and loving family. Great, great season. And I really hope that we come back for season three. Well, that's the end. I'm sad to say goodbye to this stage. It's gonna be weird to wake up and not have to come here. Time to go home. I can't believe we're finally celebrating that. <laughs> oh my can't believe this is real. Here's the rap make season two. I feel like season two was definitely a range of emotions. I think the most exciting part was just that we were back. It, you know, started off so great. And of course we got shut down. And that was scary, but we had something to look forward to when we came back. I almost feel like it was a blessing that we got shut down because we have gotten a whole year to be with all of you amazing people. Working on this set has been so cool. I mean, everyone said that they're getting so much this season. And this was my first recurring TV show lead. Like, not lead, whoa. <laughs> excitement with the beginning of starting season two, but then there was also so much chaos and loss and uncertainty and a lot of us experienced that and I had a lot of loss in my life. I'm so happy that I get to be a part of this family. The crew and the cast was just phenomenal. I've learned so much working with all of you guys. Well, I'm so sad that it's come to an end, but I really do feel like we will come back for season three 
and I feel like we've just all like changed and grown so much since we started. It is difficult to go through so much stuff, but to have that one thing that makes you grateful. And I'm so proud of you kids. You really amaze me and inspire me. I think it's just been so much fun. Just working with like such amazing people and you all are just so good at what you do. Max, you are so great and it's cool <laughs> that, you know, to have you and Wesley like, I feel like we're friendship goals. We're all family and I'm gonna miss you guys. I'm so sad that you guys are leaving. You guys are my fam. Coco, like I literally can't even get started on you. <laughs> Someone asked for an adult? Yeah!